Oh my gosh. The wedding's been, what? Canceled. Canceled. I actually am bummed about a lot of these weddings being canceled and I'm not even getting married, but because I have been waiting so long for some of these weddings, like I feel so bad. Like my heart goes out to each and every one of them that has had to postpone or cancel their wedding because of you know what. Everyone loved the video that I did that exposed all of the phenomenal YouTubers that I love to watch. And so I'm gonna do that again. And this time I'm gonna put a little spin on it. It's going to be YouTube couples. So I hope um, that you would take something or hear something and go follow them. And also um, just be sensitive to the fact that weddings are very stressful. And so the fact that you have to postpone marrying the love of your life, your best friend, um, I know that has to be tough because weddings are already stressful just in a natural state without a pandemic. I do wanna just um, go ahead and put these couples on blast because they deserve it. They really do. So I hope you stay tuned. I don't usually watch YouTube couples, but when I do, I start with Essie and Maurice. So they do have a vlog channel. I do personally like Essie's channel, um, her standalone channel. He usually makes appearances there. So I really don't know why they made the couples vlog channel, but Essie and Maurice have been together since about 2010. They are like high school, college sweethearts. They were they got together very young. Um, they reside in the state of New York um, and they are engaged. They got engaged in July 2018 and their wedding was slated for spring 2020. So obviously the wedding is canceled, postponed um, at the moment. Um, I did watch her most recent video. She said she absolutely wanted a summer wedding. So it's looking like they may have to push it until next year because of course the venue has had to cancel and postpone all the weddings that were around the time they were planning on getting married. So that's going to be a lot of backtracking. If you want to go ahead and tune in and see what happens with them and their wedding, I encourage you to do so because they are an amazing couple. They give a lot of couples advice and I love that. And basically they have grown up together. So um, 10 years worth of advice. Essie and Maurice is my first couple. My next couple is featured on the vlog channel being Nisi. So everyone knows Natural Nisi. That is her standalone channel. Um, she has a fiance named Brian, Brian Carrington. They were like the long distance relationship that I love to watch. So um, I remember back in the day, she used to call him TG because she called him travel guide for when they first met each other. She visited Texas. He kind of like took them around um, and they met on Instagram. So they got engaged in Toronto back in July of 2019. And it is so amazing because um, he had so much trouble, so many issues during the day that he um, had planned to propose. And he said it kind of reminded him of their relationship. So it, it was just like the perfect time for him to propose because it like showed how their relationship withstood so many tests and trials all the way up until their engagement. Their wedding was ex actually slated for summer 2020 and um, Obviously, for obvious reasons, it's more than likely canceled, postponed, um, but I just love them. They have a great relationship. In their most recent vlog, um, he was going to get highlighters so they could do Bible study together. And he also um, joins in with her little jam session. So again, another example of, you know, best friends. And that's a going trend with all of these couples that I'm gonna, um, talk about today so yeah they have like such a great relationship and if you're looking for um, ways to navigate a long distance distance relationship then check out being Nisi's channel some of her older vlogs and just see how she and Brian had to organize um, who's going to see the other and who was going to pay this time and who's going to stay where this time so that's a great couple to watch if you really want to do long distance dynamics so couple number three um everyone knows from the vlog channel or the youtube channel dk4l and of course they have a dk4l vlog channel 
So this is Zierra Taylor and Ken Walker. They have been together for quite some time. I can't put a stamp on it, but they got together so young. So this couple has literally grown up together, not only in a physical sense, but in a business sense. They started YouTube together. Um, they went viral off of a picture and it catapulted them into YouTube and we see what they're doing now. They are at 6 million subscribers. I actually talked about them in my last video, Exposed, and they reached the 6 million subscribers and they did a mukbang on their channel and it talked about their wedding plans. So pretty much their wedding, once again, canceled, postponed, whatever you want to call it. They reside in Atlanta, Georgia, and they are engaged. They got engaged in September 2019 in Santorini, Greece. Um, their wedding was originally slated for 2021, but um, from the mukbang, it seemed like they would likely postpone it until 2022. That's what it seemed like. Um, they did say they could go for further back in 2021, but you know, with the reality of things, so many other people may have been ahead of them. They aren't opposed to 2022. So. I know they were talking about building a house um, once they got married. So um, if you're looking for, you know, building a house, um, you know, navigating social media, um, navigating a relationship where you've grown up together, you can go refer back to some of their videos. So that is my couple number three. So the next couple, I don't usually watch YouTube couples, but when I do, I do look for a Denise a Dennis and Jackie vlog. So um, Dennis and Jackie, that's their vlog channel. Dennis Samoa and Jackie Ina. Everyone knows Jackie Ina. She is like a trailblazer in the beauty guru lane. So she has been doing this for quite some time. Um, Jackie Ina and Dennis, they reside in Los Angeles, California. They are engaged. They too got engaged in Santorini, Greece back in August of 2019. So um, I don't know if I haven't followed closely enough because I only look at their vlog channels and um, I didn't hear much about the wedding plans or anything like that. And Jackie is really good for keeping her personal life hush hush. We know what Jackie wants us to know when she wants us to know it. So um, just honestly, if you're looking for a couple who is more mature. Um, Jackie's 32, I'm not sure of Dennis's age, but if you're looking for a more mature couple, then you can look at Jackie and Dennis. Um, I do recall, if I recall correctly, Jackie has been married before. So she is a divorcee, she's 32. I don't know much about their wedding plans, but I do know that they have great vlogs. Um, they are always into something they are always on go so um just tune into their videos because um whenever jackie drops the wedding vlog it's going to be amazing i don't know if she's going to give us anything leading up to it but just stay on the lookout for that i love to watch Aaliyah j and wizard kelly so Aaliyah and menelik they have a vlog channel called Aaliyah j and wizard kelly vlogs um, and I don't even know what type of category to put their relationship in. But what I can say is this is like the happiest I feel like I've seen Aaliyah J in all the time that I've ever watched her. She just seems so secure with Menelik. So they reside in Los Angeles, California. I do know they hang out um, sometimes with um, Dennis and Jackie, but they aren't very like in the LA crowd mix and I love that about them. So um, they are dating, but in my humble opinion, they should go ahead and be, um, get engaged. And there is no wedding in the works that I know of, but in their latest vlogs um, mentioning or chronicling Menelik's keloid journey, you get to see how much they really love each other. So. It touched me so much when Menelik was saying he wants to marry Aaliyah, but he didn't feel like he could do it with the keloid situation. I was like, oh my gosh, like he's going through all of this, but still he is thinking about her. And that right there, I was like, yeah, 
they need to get married they need to stay together Menelik is like a breath of fresh air like he is so funny and you just see like Aaliyah's always been cool but you just see a different side of her when she's with him so I love them together I hope and pray all blessings over them all the good things that can happen to them happen to them especially since they opened up and showed us Menelik's journey like that was some heavy stuff because it shows you that Aaliyah is not, people paint her to be such a, a bad person, like very materialistic or, but she is so down to earth. Like, because some people, some people they're so superficial, that's the word. Some people make her out to be so superficial and some superficial people would not stick around um, with a guy who was going through that. So wow i love them and i feel like they need to get married couples or the last couple i am going to mention is tiara and um tim from tiara monet's channel and of course everybody knows tiara she's an og um they are an interracial couple so if you want to see you know an interracial couple go ahead and look at her channel tim does not make a lot of appearances but he's there and it's just amazing to see because once again she is someone that had like a polarized youtube relationship and um i don't know what happened with that relationship but here she is with tim she is riding off in the sunset um as mrs tim so congrats to tiara and tim who just got married in february 2020 they have been engaged since october 2018 and it was so crazy that they, they had like a beautiful wedding she had like this dream girls um situation going on and I love me some dream girls so I was like oh my gosh Tierra but the craziest thing happened their venue caught a fire but you know what I don't even think at the end of the day it matters like she is married to the man of her dreams at least it seems like he's the man of her dreams that she didn't even know was a man of her dreams like way back when so it's just amazing that they are married and I can't wait to see all the rest of these couples get married um, despite this pandemic. Even if you had to get legally married on um, a marriage certificate and have your ceremony later, do what you got to do because y'all, all of this love, all of this black love, I stand, I stand. Um, so check out each of their channels. If you want to see how to navigate certain types of relationships, refer back to some of their vlogs. And I'm saying that not to say to mimic your relationship after theirs but like some of them you will see actual fights and you'll see you'll see some things you'll see them get irritated and all that stuff and that didn't um get in the way of them you know moving forward and progressing with these people so um you know i stand i'm here for all of it all of it and another thing I love about each of these couples is they seem like they put each other first like all these couples they seem like that person is their person that is their number one and so that's another thing i want you to take from it if you're looking at it notice how these people are treating one another like they are best friends they are equals they see each other they respect each other they love each other and they um have so much respect for one another and that's another thing that you may want to you know let seep into your bones when you're watching them like i deserve i deserve i deserve that and once again not telling you to mimic these relationships but just um you know take some tips like you deserve to be respected you deserve to be treated um well you deserve to be able to be yourself and that person loves that like something that i always love to say is i want to find someone that loves me for everything I am and everything that I'm not. And when I watch these couples, I feel like I see that in all of them. So um, my prayers to all of them, they all get married, they happily married, have babies, and they last for years and years and years to come. <laughs> so to black love, I'm rooting for everybody black. And I mean, Tim, you're, you're in the mix too. I'm rooting for you and Tiara too, honey. Okay, all right. So I hope you all enjoyed this video. Thumbs up, like, subscribe. Let me know of any other YouTube couples that you may follow that I did not mention. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much everything. Bye.